Hey guys, this is April at Georgia Mom Plans. I have another planner haul for you today. This is going to be my October haul, and it's really small. Um, I have been cutting back. I haven't really needed a lot of kits for the end of the year, so I've been holding back purchasing, um, waiting for new releases for 2023 and winter and that sort of thing. So I think I'm going to actually combine this very small haul with my November haul. I'll probably have more um, next month, especially with sales and Black Friday and that sort of thing. So I wanted to go ahead and show you these things because one, um, my November kit is in here, so I need to use that for my November lineup, and I wanted to start using these things. So um, let me get this out of the way, and I will go shop by shop, and once I'm done with these, I'll see you for my November portion. Alright, my first order is from My Newest Addiction. I have been loving the shop recently. All of her new releases have just been really great and I love her, her new formats. So, I picked up my November kit from her shop and let me show you the freebies first. So this was just the shop freebie that came with some functional items in rose gold and then I put in Cassie's name of Sweet Like Honey Plans. Her freebie is on clear paper in rose gold as well. And then, like I said, I picked up the November monthly kit. I picked up the A5 wide. I used the Sadie's Stickers uh, 8.5 by 11 planner. We shall see how this lines up, but it looks, you know, pretty standard. So this kit is in gold foil, and I really love the colors. It's got some Thanksgiving vibes, but it also is just pretty. So um, these are all of your top bars here and your empty boxes. Then you've got your holidays, some icons, um, some quarter boxes, and full boxes here. And then this page you've got um, some deco, some boxes, um, your sidebar, which I picked the deco sidebar. Um, you've got some washi strips and then your date covers. Those little dates with the bows are super cute. And then look at those little leaves that are extra. Really, really cute. Um, here, this is how the deco um, sidebar is vertically there. And then I added on this sheet. This is the um, lace trims or just the trims. The name of the matching weekly clip was Grace. So this is Grace Trims. So you got these really pretty like torn washi and then the floral uh, elements as well. So I thought this would be really pretty to layer in my uh, monthly and then I could also pull some of these into any weekly spreads I have that may match the colors. I just thought it'd be pretty to pull in a little bit extra. And then the kit also comes with this script um, on clear papers. So you've got your days of the week, a happy birthday, some headers, paydays, and bill dues really pretty there. Um, I don't think I've ever used a monthly kit from My Newest Addiction. I've used her weekly kits and icons, so excited to try out her monthly. And like I said, I've just been loving her um, new kit formats and her a la carte options, so really excited to use this in November. And that was everything in this order from My Newest Addiction. All right, this next order is from Fox and Pip, another shop that I absolutely love, one of my favorite character sticker shops, and um, this was during Amanda's birthday sale. So this freebie here, um, she said, was just herself on a sheet, just a lot of uh, assorted icons and um, banners, little character there, so that was a super nice freebie. And then the sheets that I picked up, picked up this zoo visit sheet. I thought this would be cute and really neutral to mark when we go to the zoo. And then um, sleepy coffee. I surprisingly never have had this sheet, so I thought this would be nice to mark work. Go away germs, definitely have lots of germs with my son being in daycare. Football love work from home. Another one that I did not have, and I do work from home, so I thought it was appropriate to pick that one up. And then these are restocks. I love her little Build Your Squad sheets. So for my husband, I get the male adult one. You can pick skin tone, hair color, and the outfit. For myself, I get friend eight. And then for my son, I get baby one. Honestly, this will probably be the last time I buy the baby sheet because He's two and a half. It's probably time to get the little boy one. Ugh, but I just love how you can pair these together. They're just so, so cute. So, um, some new sheets and some of my favorites. And that is everything in this order from Fox and Pip.
All right, this next order is from a new to me shop. I'm so excited. I always love trying new shops and I haven't been as diligent. So I'm really excited that I um, am trying a new shop for this month. So this is Blissful Jade Designs and I've been following um, the owner on her planner account for a while and then she opened her shop I think a few months back and she is taking orders uh, via Instagram and you just pay through PayPal so I was excited to try out some of her things so she is blissful jade designs that's her shop and her planner Instagram is keepsake plans and let's go over the freebies so you've got this really pretty like thank you journaling card oh and she did um, write a little handwritten note on the back there super sweet and then this is an all orders freebie just a nice little floral deco sheet there and then this is what I picked up I got some of her scripts on transparent matte paper so I got planning time I really like this font and then I got the November slash Thanksgiving sampler. So excited for that one. And then also the October slash Halloween sampler. And I haven't done any of my memory spreads for October yet. So perfect that I am filming this so I can use these in some of my memory spreads. Um, these are gorgeous. I got them all unfoiled and they are so pretty. To be honest, she may not do foil. It may be all unfoiled. Don't quote me on that, but they are really pretty. And then I also picked up some of her journaling kits. So this one is called Cozy Weekend. She has quite a few different kits in her shop. So definitely go check out everything on her Instagram. So this is the deco sheet. So you've got some larger deco as well as some floral elements. And then this is the floral sheet, a ton of florals to work with. And then this is the actual journaling sheet. So you've got some washi strips, some torn um, paper, some layering items, more deco, and then your days of the week. So those are the um, three pages I got for her journaling kits. I believe you order those a la carte. And then I also picked up her large days of the week. Um, again, these are unfoiled on transparent mat. And I just thought these would be really nice to use like in my monthlies um, as well as my 2023 planner setups. I will definitely use these. So you've got Monday through Sunday three sets. And then you've also got four this week. So actually you've got four sets. This is perfect for a whole month. You've got four sets of Monday through Sunday and then four this week. Really nice. So I'm really excited to try out her shop. She has a ton more scripts and kits in her shop. So definitely go check out Blissful Jade Designs. All right, so that is everything in my October haul. Like I said, I did not pick up a ton um, through the end of September as well as through October. Really been trying to rein in my purchasing. I am sure come November that is going to go out the window. So I will combine this with my November haul coming up next. Hey guys, this is April at Georgia Mom Plans. I have the second half of my haul video for you today. So this is going to be my November haul. Um, like I said in the first part, I am combining this with October. I did not have a lot of items from October, but combining all of this is going to be the perfect amount of things to show you. And then next month with all of my Black Friday shopping, I will definitely have a nice big haul. So I have quite the mix of items today, some planners, some planning accessories, pens, and stickers. And a few of these things I picked up are gifts, but I still want to show you just because I think they're really great quality. So um, I'm going to start with the planner, planner accessories, then we'll move into some stickers. So let me move this out of the way and we will go shop by shop. All right, this first order is from Moxie Life, and I am so excited. This is the second year that I have ordered um, their planners. I have not personally used them, but I have used some of their other items, and I'm excited for a few of these things. So first, um, it came with this little like overview card and tells you how to like earn points and that sort of thing, and where to follow them on social media. And then this is like their little logo. I, I believe it's like a sticker. Um, I saw online what it is. I honestly don't remember. <laughs> um, this is the item that I was the most excited for. It is their Moxie Life uh, bookmark stencil and it is metal. I have been using this for about two weeks now and I really, really like it. Um, I always use the like clear plastic rulers from Erin Condren, but my slice tool would cut through them. And this, um, I have not, knock on wood, have not messed it up yet with my slice tool. I've also used it to cut washi. I've used the stencils for checklists. I haven't used any of the box stencils yet, but 
I'm really excited about this and it can be a bookmark in your planner as well. So I was really excited when I saw this item released. And then I ordered during their launch. So I got this for free. It's their 2022 Year in Reflections. I've never used any of Moxie Life's goal setting systems, but I still thought this little reflection notebook would be really good to go through um, just so I can see how the year went and see if there's anything I want to focus on next year. Um, and this is a really nice like bound notebook with a lot of different prompts for you. So I was really excited they're releasing this. Um, I think you can purchase it as well, but I did get it as a freebie. The next item that I ordered, I was really excited about. This is the weekly overview notepad. So you have a space to write the date of, of the week, any focus, and then it's Monday through Sunday. And then this is a actual sticky notepad. So I like to pre-plan my week. So then when I am actually putting the stickers in my planner, I can reference this. So I'll be using this every week to pre-plan, um, to plan out um, you know, any appointments, any to-dos, that sort of thing. Um, and I just really like that it is a notepad. So I was excited for that and it's really thick. You get a ton of pages. And then the final thing that I picked up, I didn't pick up any of their new launch planners. This is actually the planner from last year and it's the six month undated, but it was like heavily discounted. So I picked it up. This is the blush color cover and it's like a um, faux leather cover. And like I said, this undated six month vertical, um, it does have all of the standard goal setting pages here at the top or here at the front. And then it has unmarked tabs. So like I said, you could use it, start it whenever. And then you have a monthly spread, um, your monthly goals, and then your weekly actions, and then your weekly layout. Um, I do really like Moxie Life's layout. Um, I feel like in the future it may be one that I use. I already have my planner set for 2023, but I do really like their layout um, and I like her paper a lot. So this is a really great planner. And like I said, these were discounted since they're from last year's uh, design. Their design has been updated a little bit. Um, so you have six months and then at the back you have an assessment so you can do your quarterly assessments um, on your goals and then it has a extras tab which has future plans here it has six months of uh, future boxes and then I think this is all yeah just lined pages something that I really really appreciate is since this is undated they gave you these um, clear tab covers um, you have two sets, so January through December, so two years worth of tabs, so you can date these. So if you pick up another undated planner, you'll have more tabs to use. I thought that was really generous. Um, you know, most planners like this, you would have to purchase that extra. So the fact that it came with it was really nice. And it's clear with white ink, so it'll go nicely with what's already printed on the other tabs. So you do have a pocket here at the back. Um, pretty sturdy. You got pockets on both sides. And then this last page here, you have some stickers. You've got some dots, um, some icons, flags, and labels. I think it's just one page here. Yeah, one page of stickers, all multicolor. And then here at the back, you have a big back pocket to store anything you need. Really, really appreciate this. Um, it is a nice metal coil, silver coil. And then you also have a little elastic closure here. I think Moxie Life has really amazing products and if you are into goal setting and goal planning, I think it really is a great option. Honestly, I have not tried a goal planner. Um, it's just not something that I have been interested in, but if that is something that you're interested in, I think this is really great products and they have things outside of planners as well. So this is everything in my order from Moxie Life. I do want to mention that I used Taylor of Tattooed Teacher Plans affiliate link. I will have her um, channel linked below so you can definitely use her affiliate link um, to give her some credit because she is definitely the reason that I um, purchased this. So if this prompts you to look at anything, I would suggest using her link as well. All right, this next order is from Erin Condren. I haven't ordered from Erin Condren since 2020. Um, 
everyone knows the drama that went on with them in 2020 um, and I have just not honestly even looked at their products. Um, I know they have been making a lot of changes to their uh, company and Erin Erin Con Condren herself is no longer associated um, and I have seen, you know, more people using it more. I've noticed the changes they've made with their company. So I um, decided during their early Black Friday sale to take a look and some of these products just jumped out as me and most of these are gifts. So I was really excited to pick them up. I'm going to start with these items here and then show you this larger item. So um, these fine tip markers here, these are the warm neutrals. These came as a freebie when I ordered during the early Black Friday sale and I think I will include them in a gift. I have heard that the Erin Condren markers are kind of hit or miss if people like them. I have a ton of markers so I don't really need them but they were a nice freebie. And then this journal I am so excited about. It is such nice quality. So I think this was the camel color, but it is like the faux leather bound notebook. And it's just lined pages. Um, yeah, the focus lined notebook is what it is called. I got the faux leather cover and I got it um, embossed here. This, These are my dad's initials. I'm going to give this to him as a gift. I want him to keep track of stories and sayings and stuff so that um, he can pass this down to my son. Um, and I just thought this was a really nice gift. Um, it's just a simple notebook, but it's really nice quality. And then these are some of their notepads. Their notepads are really nice quality as well. They have a ton of different designs and you can personalize them. So this is actually one of the wedding designs. I can't remember the name of it, but like I said, they have a ton of different options. I just thought these uh, pretty uh, roses were nice with the pink. Um, it's just a really large lined notepad. They're not sticky notes. They're just um, individual notes. But I got it um, personalized with Mrs. Inoko. This was for my mother-in-law and my sister-in-law. I thought this would be a nice little gift for them. Something they can always use and is also pretty. And then this is something I've had on my list for probably a year now. I saw Taylor of Tattoo Teacher Plans pick this up. It is a personalized packing list and I always make packing lists. I mean, I love making lists for anything and being able to actually personalize my own like list that's pre-printed I just thought was so nice and like I said I've literally had it written on a sticky note on my desk for about a year now to pick this up if I ever place Erin Condren order again so I'm so glad I remembered so this is their packing notepad again it's not a sticky note it's just a notepad but you got to pick um, every header of these boxes which is perfect so um, I specifically designed this one thinking of our beach trip because that is our biggest trip of the year. So I did Griffin, um, April and Ty, which is myself and my husband, toiletries, outdoor, because we bring so many, you know, outdoor things to the beach, and then pets, sleep, food, and other. Obviously, I can change these as needed, move them around, but like these up here are always going to be the same, and those are perfect, and I just think this is so nice. Like I said, I love their quality, and it's just so cool that you get to personalize it. So that is my personalized packing list. And the last thing that I picked up for myself, I had saw, I want to say Julie of Julie's Plans, but it could have been someone else, share this. And I was like, oh, that's nice. But then when I saw it on the website, I was like, oh, yeah, I want one of those. So this is the acrylic desk organizer. It's in the mid-century circles design, but honestly, you can't even see the design. It's really just a clear organizer. I kept this box here to remind me to pull it off my desk because I have been using it since the day it came in. I've been using it and I love it. So this is the small. They have a small and a large. And then it says, organize and store your writing tools, art supplies, makeup, and more. So, I mean, it can literally be used for anything. And it's really nice quality. So let me show you. Like I said, I have been using it. So I have it loaded up here. So you have one, two, three, four little shelves and they are slanted so your items aren't going to fall out and they do have little uh, rubber feet on the bottom which I really appreciate. The top one is open so I keep my um, planning supplies here at the top so I can just grab them out and use them. So I've got my pen, um, the current highlighter I'm using in my planner, my cutting tool, 
whiteout and my tweezers right here on top. And then in all of the other compartments, I have my highlighters. So these are my Rytec retractable highlighters. I just had them in a cup on my desk, but this is really nice. I can see them all, pull them out. I kind of have them slightly color coordinated in here. And it's just fun to look at on my desk. It's really pretty, super functional, and I kind of want another one. I have a bamboo organizer on my desk right now, but these like clear acrylic are really pretty. This would be real, this larger size would be really nice for like Tombos or dot markers, you know, anything like that that you use. Um, this one was a nice size for this amount of pens. I think this was like a 20 four pack maybe, um, but the larger one would definitely be nice if you have like a big collection of Tombos or something. But I really like this. It's very thick plastic. It seems durable. I've been using it for a little over a week now and I really, really like it. So I want to say it was a pretty decent price. Again, I did pick all of this up during the early back Friday sale, so I think I got everything like 30% off. It was a really nice sale. Um, but I'm just so excited for these items. Um, I don't know still, you know, how much I'll be shopping from Erin Condren just because I don't use their planners anymore. I, I think it was really nice for gifts. It, we'll see, you know, they could come out with something that I like, but I, I like supporting smaller shops in general. But these were some really nice items to have as gifts. And this was everything in my order from Erin Condren. All right, now we are moving into my sticker orders and I've got some really pretty orders to show you. So this first order is from Nikki Plus Three, one of my favorite, favorite shops. And I picked this up, I wanna say it was during a sale, but I can't remember. <laughs> I cannot, but I did get a lot of freebies, which was really nice. So you've got these cute little pumpkins, some foiled days of the week, two sets. Um, some transparent matte deco. These are really pretty colors. Be nice for fall. And then her floral numbers. You've got four sets of one through nine and some zeros. Super, super cute there. And then for what I actually picked up, um, I'm really excited for this order. I picked up some items that I don't typically use. But first off, let's start with the monthly. This is my December monthly. I love Nikki Plus 3's monthly kits. I mean, all of her stuff I love, but her monthly kits have been a longtime favorite. And I love white and green at Christmas. I think it is so pretty. And this has light gold foil on it. Just simple and pretty. So you've got your top bars, some full boxes, and some labels. And then your empty boxes, some layering items, your date dots, florals, some small little splashes. And then um, this is definitely an updated page since the last monthly kit I got. You've got um, icons, some fancy boxes, uh, quarter boxes, more labels, and washi strips. And then I chose the decorative header here. These colors are so pretty and I love the little baking scene at the bottom. And then she also includes your monthly scripts. So you have Monday through Sunday, payday, day off, appointment, bill due, happy birthday, and then the holidays as well as some headers for the sidebar. So that was everything in the monthly kit. And then I picked up some of her um, transparent matte sheets. Um, I really want to use these in my new planner, which is my plum paper planner. And I just think these are so stinking cute. All right, so this is the winter outfits cool tone. So perfect for January. And then the winter trees, how gorgeous are those? Gorgeous and then the Winter Mountains. So I definitely have um, kits assigned that I'm going to like pair some of these items with. Especially I use a lot of leftover kits. So when I don't have full boxes or things like that, I can pull these in as some deco and they're just so pretty. So that was everything in this order from Nikki plus three. All right, this next order is from Lexi Kylie Designs. This is a shop that I have really been enjoying recently. I think this is my second or third order and I placed another order on Black Friday and I'm just really excited. So first you have this little um, thank you card. That is really cute to put in your planner. And then this was the November freebie. So it says November, you've got some deco there and this is so cute, talk turkey to me. Super cute freebie. And then what I actually picked up, so I picked up some of her 
um, transparent matte sheets. Again, I thought these would be nice to pair in my plum paper planner. So I got her tran or her snowflake sampler, like I said, on transparent matte. You got some blues, pinks, and purples there and snowflakes. And then I got her abstract tree sampler. I think this is so cute for Christmas. And you've got the like deep red, green, and beige there. Really cute. And then this um, is on premium matte. This is her mini note squares in the neutral colorway. Those are just super cute little note um, to include in a spread. And then I picked up her um, journal kit. This one's called Freezing Season. And again, this with those trees from Nikki Plus 3 and those winter outfits will be so perfect to pair together in my plum paper planner. Um, I have seen uh, Taylor of Tattoo Teacher Plans use uh, Lexi Kylie's journaling kits and they're really cute. So this will be the first journaling kit I used from her and I'm really excited. I like these nice neutral colors and I think I'll be using this in January, I believe. So really excited for all of these items. And this, and this was everything in this order from Lexi Kylie Designs. All right, this next order is from Nicole Alexia Designs. You know, this is a shop that I absolutely love and I PR for, so excited for everything that I pick up. So let's start with the freebies. This is my freebie. Um, I kept it through Thanksgiving. I need to see about updating it for winter, but it's really cute. Some little fall deco there and she gives you random foil so this one is on silver and then this was a freebie set of headers this is a like matte silver it's really pretty little snowflake headers love that and then she released some two dollar tuesday um like christmas deco that i was so excited about so i picked up the candy cane banner in silver then the gingerbread banner in silver and then the poinsettia divider in silver. And how cute are these? I can't remember what she called these, but they're just little like ornament garlands in silver. Oh, ornament flourish. I didn't even realize she had the names right there. So I actually got that candy cane divider in gold and silver, then the gingerbread divider, and then holly banner. And this, the ornament flourish, and I got this one in silver and in gold. I thought I got everything in silver and gold and I believe I did. I just have it out of order. So ornament flourish in it's silver and gold and then the snowflake wreath in gold. How gorgeous is that? And then this is the same holly banner that I had in silver and the gingerbread divider that I also had in silver. So I got almost everything in gold and silver and this is on her transparent map just super cute going to be so fun to use during the holidays some cute little okay and i got that one too so i did i got everything in gold and silver those are the colors i use most at christmas and those are just gonna be so stinking cute and then of course i picked up a kit this is her cozy kit i'm going to be using this in january um i love blue in january and this is you know this could be picking up your Christmas tree or it could be taking down your Christmas tree. So I thought it still worked for January. And this is her three page kit. It's in silver foil. You've got your full boxes and a washi strip. Then all of your boxes, you got fancy boxes, quarter boxes, half boxes. And then the last page is your date covers, sidebar items, and then your two washi strips, all foiled. So, so pretty. I love, love her kits. Use them all the time, and I'm excited for this seasonal deco as well. So that was everything in this order from Nicole Alexia Designs. All right, this is the last order for this part of the haul. This is an order from Paper Trail Plans, a shop that I absolutely love. And they have some of the best packaging. It's just so pretty. So I always include it to show you. So you've got this little envelope that everything comes in. And look how pretty this is. A little wing there. All the stickers were tucked in right here. So stinking pretty. And then this was a $2 Tuesday order I placed. So first, this it was the fall freebie in gold. So pretty. I'm definitely going to use a ton of these scripts in my... November uh, spreads. I actually still have October spreads to finish as well. So definitely will be using that. I love their transparent matte paper and their foiling is gorgeous. So for this $2 Tuesday, they released the days or the um, 
every month foiled. So I did this last year too and I picked them all up in black and I still have a ton of those. So I picked up some a variety of foil colors and I kind of chose the foil on what I tend to use in those months. So I got the January, February sheet in silver, March, April in light gold, May, June in silver, July, August in light gold, September, October in rose gold, then November and December, I think I got, yes, both. I got gold and silver because I use a ton of silver in December and I use a lot of gold in November. So that was the only one I doubled up on. Uh, I have a, a lot of these, like I said, left over unfoiled in black. So if I'm ever using a foil that I don't have you know, the right color, I can use black. And then a ton of freebies you get also have foiled months. So I really tend to collect those and use them in my spreads as well. But this was such a good $2 Tuesday and I got her modern font. They have a few different fonts, again, that I love. Always appreciate some pretty stickers. So this was everything in my order from Paper Trail Plans. All right, guys, that is everything in my November haul. I got a lot of stuff um, and stuff that I'm really excited about. I've got some gifts, some stickers, some planning supplies, a new planner, just a nice variety of things that I was so excited to show you. I've literally had these sitting stacked on my desk and looking at them every day. So excited to show y'all and so excited to start using them. Like I said, I've already been using a few of these things <laughs> because they're just so pretty. So, I will have all of the shops linked below as well as any discount codes that I have and any um, one that I mentioned, like Taylor, I'll have their um, handles listed below as well. Uh, and if you are not already, definitely go follow me over on Instagram. I'm at Georgia Mom Plans, and you can see how I use all of these items in my spreads. I do post over there very regularly. And if you are not already, please subscribe to my channel. I do try and post videos for you weekly, planner related content, whether it be hauls, kit lineups, um, plan with me's, planner setups, all of those types of things. If there's any video requests that you have, definitely leave them below. I'm always open to requests. And if you picked up any of these same items, let me know. Or if you have any shop suggestions, I always am looking for new shops to try as well. If you're using any of these planners that I talked about, I'd love to hear how you are using them. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you are not already, please subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate you watching. I hope y'all enjoyed and I will see you guys next time. Bye.